ask them just to make them think of what is going to be presented <coughs> like uh, how, how do people feel when they miss or when they lose someone very important <coughs> in their life so after setting the scene I think uh, and we are dealing with the sound um, I as a teacher am going to ask them to close their eyes so as to focus more on one thing that is the uh, hearing and while their eyes are closed I'm going to read for them one part of the uh, poem for example the first part stop all the clocks cut off the telephones prevent the dogs from barking with the juicy form silence the pianos and with pop drum, drums bring out the cup let the mourners come then to check that they have understood or grasped the meaning I can set some questions as comprehension questions of course they are going to answer me with their eyes open now tell me what is he going to do to express his sadness for losing this person and I get the answers then can be other questions in another way asking which one do you think are possible and which one are impossible now if the question is for you which one do you think are possible to be done and which are impossible to be done and get the answer for them so it can be in a sort of checking comprehension and all these things are done through one thing that is the sound or hearing and the same activity can be repeated for all other versions of the poem so, yeah. thank you like to go next? Yeah. Ortiz is going for the tape? No. This is my own. Yes. And Ortiz was with Thank you. Yelena.